With demolition permits in hand, crews are getting ready to bring down walls and build a new Queens Medical Center west Oahu. We took a tour of the old facility for an idea of what will change. There's a lot that will go. Donning hard hats and construction vests, members of the media took a tour inside Queens Medical Center West Oahu, a before shot. Before crews start tearing out the walls next week, what strikes you the most? The orange lines snaking their way throughout the hospital, and this one word summing it up, demo. Those lines tell workers what needs to go. This is a building that's over 20 years old and needs a lot of work to make new. So at the end of this, we will have a new hospital here. This is the emergency room. It was the second busiest in the state. It will now be tripled in size, increased from 10 beds to 23. And this is the newest rendering of what it'll look like once the work is complete. Two operating rooms will be doubled to four. Work will be done not only on walls, but in the infrastructure to accommodate the specialized lighting and technology used in surgery. Most of the equipment at the old hospital was sold, some of it through publicized garage sales and was not part of the deal. Yet some things remain. You see that X-ray box in the in the back. Um, this hospital, when it was built, they they put that in. We don't use X-ray boxes anymore. We have TV. We have monitors. Uh, images, radio, radiology images are now stored and transmitted through the internet. The labor-intensive surgeries like cardiovascular and organ transplants will remain downtown. The West Oahu campus will be the community hospital, offering general and orthopedic surgeries. Separated by miles and traffic, but still one Queens. If you do an uh, x-ray out here, or you get a sound wave study of your heart done here, it can be sent to our central campus where we can read things, uh, get things done appropriately, and our turnaround time uh, should uh, Optimize patient care. And so we hope to Queens officials hope to open the doors to the Queens Medical Center West Oahu in the spring of next year. It'll be quite interesting to see this construction as it goes along.